All right, we've had a couple inches of rain. Of course, I still get this filling up. I still got to do something of that. But uh, mounting up all that dirt there really helped because you, it all goes down that way and then it hits the French drain. And then of course I got the French drain there. And it did pour down there a little bit, but the French drain took care of it. Let's go out here. I despise rain anymore. Let me come on out here. I do need to uh, make a little awning there. That would be nice. And as you can see, let's go over here and look at the French drain. She's a gushing. Oh yeah, all the way down the hill. I don't want to get wet. <laughs> My truck doesn't even fit in this thing all the way. Oh, man. It's that, it's that season again. I just got done mowing the grass. Thank goodness. So I wouldn't be able to mow it again for a couple days. Uh, this here is a spot I gotta address. I think I'll mound up some more dirt here. Because the French drain start it it comes this way and then it comes around here and goes there and straight down. Actually the French drain is right here. And there's a big hole right here where the French drain curves that way. But I think it's just full and it's seeping in, just taking its time. Because right along the carport is where the French drain is. But it's working. But we just got we just got a ton of rain quick. And Waldo, man. I think because his hearing's out now that he feels the thunder. And it scares him because he was never afraid of thunder and lightning before but let's go see how he's doing well he's calmed down be amazed what milk bones will do yeah i gotta take that thing and put it on the outside because i, I watched that i figured out how water's getting in you can see it's dripping right there and then it's streaming down so all i got to do is move that to the outside that problem's cured uh, I gotta go ahead and get some walls on this thing, man. You know, I got too many projects going at once, I know. But, you know, like the kitchen. You know, I, I, I just gotta do that. I get, I get paid once a month, guys. And so, when I get my money, then I go buy the materials I need. Now, I pretty much got all I need there, but I need screws. Other things are more important. I'm in no rush, so... You know, that can wait. So I've been doing other things, you know. Well, we'll go see you guys. Turn your light out. I've been doing other things. I got this clean. Well, it doesn't look so clean now because I had to move all that stuff out of the way. But I've been getting that clean. Let me go up to the loft to show you what I've been doing up there. And just so you can see, I haven't done anything. About all I've done is put the metal up. I did start to put wood across here. Oh, that wall gets just giving me fits, man it is it's it's out of square so i've got my counter here exactly where i want it all the way even and this is what we get in the back and there's nothing i can do about that wall see how far out of the wall it is over there compared to up here so i think my answer is probably going to be a big thick backsplash uh that way you wouldn't be able to tell but yeah, this this isn't going to take much long to finish. But I've, I've been working on the loft, just cleaning it up a little bit. There's Miss Rooster. Let me get a light because it's going to be dark up there. All right, yeah, it's a mess yet, but uh, I'm trying to go through some of these. It's a lot better than it was. It was all piled up here. But I'm trying to go through a lot of these boxes. I've got. 25 30 years worth of junk in them uh, And I just shoved up here when I bought the place You know and there's just old pictures things like that uh, computer cords so I Want to get this floor put in I don't want I Don't want to all oh, that light. I don't want that flooring sitting out in the shed all summer and getting hot so 
when you get that carpet well I don't even really need to worry about that carpet tack I'm just gonna build a little straight down wall just you know maybe five six inches out square that up a little and run my electrical cables and stuff in there it's already painted up here uh, I just got to put the flooring on but yeah I'm shuttling junk from one place to another place you know I got stuff like them boards <sighs> so that's what's going on with that and then I find a lot of things like this and you know I'm always saying I know I got one of them but I can't find it yeah well there it is you know I'll just this is stuff from the desk I had when I lived in Tulsa that I shoved in a bag. It's like my first solo flight plaque. Pictures of my first two dogs. I do need to get that down there and hung up. That's Molly and that's Lakota. Oh, what else? Oh, yeah, I found that stupid thing. Drill Sergeant Academy, 1987. Yeah, the frames broke. I don't like hanging stuff that that I did. I don't know. I've just never been that way. Hang on. Let me turn this light down. <sighs> All right. Go down these steep steps. What are you doing, Rooster? <laughs> I have to go down these like sideways. Did you want to say hi to the people? Huh? She's like a tap dancer on this floor. And let me tell you something, guys. It's like every single day I got a vacuum. It, it just shows, and I knew it would, it just shows every little, and you live in the country, you're pulling in every piece of grass, and yeah, I just vacuumed the whole thing yesterday, swept it. It does need a mopping now, but. Ah. Oh yeah, and I did lower that. So now it looks straight. I can look at that and it looks straight to me. Because that was driving me nuts. And it's actually out of level. It's because that ceiling up there slopes upward. And that is due to the fact that this whole front section, when I got the place, had been sagging down. I don't know if it had gotten wet or whatever. And then I knocked out some walls and made it worse. But right now, I've got support post here here that's not really one but you know I got a big one here this whole wall because there was a wall uh, of a pantry here and I tore all that out and it shouldn't have been a load bearing wall these have uh, floor joists across but they joined them together and it wasn't a good job that they did so all right and I picked this up the other day at Walmart for 39 bucks because my radio. I dropped my radio and broke it. And this one is Bluetooth and then it's got the, you know, the charging plug. And then you can unplug it. It'll play for 10 hours. And I can take it anywhere I go. Man, it's got some pretty good sound. So I, I thought that was pretty cool. Can't play it long. Yeah, yeah, yeah. all right all right guys another lousy video but it's a video i haven't put one up here in weeks and we will bear with me it's the summer i think it was two summers ago and hardly do it yeah when i was doing the addition i started that and it was so hot i couldn't do anything so I, I was doing stupid videos like this because i couldn't get out in the heat although it's not hot now but I'm just, you know, waiting to restock on things. And, you know, like I've said before, I'm in no rush. But I do, and I ain't one to make secret things. I'm not. But I do got something humongous coming up. But it is uh, seven, eight months out. And y'all just have to wait. Um, trust me, when that time gets here, you will see. It's going to be huge. I'll have a premiere video. We'll have ticker tape parade, the tinsel, all that. Don't know. But it's months out, so I thought I'd just throw you a little. I'm not one of them channels, you know, that throw the beans, but this is way down the road. 
but things are coming. Now, and hopefully we get fiber because, man, I'm sitting here and this thing keeps going out because of Starlink, you know, it's satellite, and I think, I think it's all going south of us now. We're there. I'm going to get a little more rain. I don't know. This thing's keep popping up, popping up. It's what it does this time of year. All right, guys, stay tuned. Check out my other channel. Uh, I do post there every morning. Pretty late this morning, but every morning, seven days a week, usually. If I miss one, uh, it's because I have something going on, which I do two days. No, one day next week. And then well, I got it written on the calendar, and then two days the next week. I got to get up early. I'm not going to mention what days, but I got uh, appointments. So usually what I'll do is put one up late if, if I do that not promising it you know go check it out it is called the dog man you recognize that name I know that's what this channel used to be called but I'm sorry for confusing people but you know the channel name switched switched around fit better now I think thanks for watching guys happy trails